Uh, good afternoon to you. Well, um, the Minister of Energy has been uh, directed to come to Parliament to explain on the issue of uh, rising fuel prices. On three occasions, we've been appearing and uh, we've been talking about the law that does not allow a government or its agency to really come in and uh, regulate the prices. So we thought about a system that will see the government of Uganda supply petroleum products or oil products to the country uh, to make sure that we receive the products at an affordable you know, price. And so we thought about our own company, the Uganda National Oil Company, which we want to build, which we, we want to really give an opportunity to have their capacity enhanced in as far as the business of uh, bulk importation and supply of petroleum product is concerned. Uganda National Oil Company is mandated by law to act on behalf of government to do business, but also to keep our shares in the upstream and downstream development of our petroleum resources. So we thought about enhancing their capacity to really begin doing business with one of their suppliers uh, to see to it that they supply the Ugandan oil marketing companies without, without any suffering. So um, we looked at the principal act of the petroleum supply uh, law, which was enacted in 2003, and we saw provisions which required amendment. So one of the provision is to really delete a provision that was talking about the oil marketing companies and insert a provision that will mandate the national oil, the Uganda National Oil Company, the mandate for it to supply the products to the rest of the oil marketing companies in Uganda. We also looked at other provisions that required um, uh, um, an inclusion of uh, a definition of uh, a licensed uh, a licensed oil marketing company, which was missing, and all these these amendments were to really uh, do with empowering Uganda National Oil Company to do the business. So today, I've laid on table before uh, Parliament that bill, an amendment bill, to the. Petroleum Supply Act of 2003. It has been read for the first time and it is subjected to the Committee of Natural Resources for scrutiny. And I know that we shall be appearing to that committee so that they ask questions. And uh, from there, the report will be presented to Parliament and we shall debate. We shall do second reading and then third reading. This law is needed, like yesterday because we don't want to be uh, pulled into again into the Kenyan system of government to government system where Uganda has no say, but you just have to follow that system to get the products into the country. And that system has like three layers, which if we mandated UNOC to be the supplier, will do away with those layers and then simplify the business. And those layers come with a cost. And probably it's why, it is why we, the end consumers, consume the products at a relatively higher price, where if we don't go through those layers, we will see a relatively lower price. So we are trying to make sure that we answer the question, which always comes up. What is Uganda doing? Fuel prices, sometimes, <laughs> 
Kenya can decide to make their own oil marketing companies a priority where we have scarcity. And the Ugandan oil marketing companies become secondary. So that leaves us with insecurity of supply. And the security of supply is very critical. There are two things which are critical, the prices, but also the security of supply. Sometimes there are tendencies of holding onto the product. So with the UNOC being our eye into the business, I think we will even do away with holding so that we have weight supply throughout the season. So we are going to do this transfer, this policy shift carefully because we don't want the market to suffer. We don't want Ugandans to suffer. We don't want to have a blackout in as far as supply of product is concerned in the country. We've already have an engagement with the all oil uh, marketing companies, and UNOCO is continuing to engage with them. We had to introduce this. We have engaged the Kenyan government to the level of the president, and so we are moving together. We are not just moving as Uganda without uh, uh, involving Kenya. We appreciate the government of Kenya for all the time we've, been, we've moved with them, but time has come for Uganda to also come up with uh, a new arrangement that will improve, you know, the supply of products uh, for, for, for Ugandans. So we've engaged the Kenyan government at the level of president, presidency, but also at the level of minister to minister. We have engaged the Kenyan uh, pipeline company. We have engaged the Energy and Petroleum Regulatory Authority of Kenya, we are still engaging. And I'm now at the level of engaging parliament to give me the legal support. And I have high hopes that I'll get this support. So this is what we are doing, and this is where we are today. Thank you very much. <laughs> Ntambule mungu wa Muganda. Your capacity to deliver this work. Do you want me to commit to yourself? And deliver it. Do you want me to hold a Bible and I swear? First of all, you are in charge of the other reserve. 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 No, 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 don't tell lies. Um, by the way, at one time, Uganda has been performing better than Kenya, and yet we are landlocked. So regarding ginger reserves, uh, UNOC was handed over these reserves, 30 million liter storage capacity, and UNOC is working with their, you know, uh, 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 counterparts, you know, uh, business people they are, they've been working with. And when you go to Ginger, you will see a different, you will see a different picture altogether. That storage terminal is being upgraded. But we are also planning to construct a bigger storage terminal which will store 320 million liters of uh, uh, fuel. And we are uh, planning to get the fuel from the refinery in Hoima, which is going to refine 60,000 barrels of crude. We shall construct a pipeline for this finished product to, to bring the product to Mpiji, Namoavla, and UNOC is championing the construction of this storage terminal. We will also work with private sector. We have private sector where they have really tried to make sure that they, that they have storage. When needs arise, we will work with them. There is Mahati with 70 million, uh, million uh, liters capacity. We are not going to throw them away. We will work with them. So the government working with Uganda National Oil Company will see to it that we have security of supply. 
This is what I can assure the country. Maybe to understand it better. Uh, well, first of all, those 45 days are not written in heaven where I can't access. I will request the speaker to use his discretion to fast track this law. That's one. Okay? What was the other question? Yeah, I was like, I saw five, 45 days. They are too small for you to prepare yourself to start this election. If you have this bill in place after 45 days, do you have the money to start doing this bill? As you know, do you have the budget? The other issue was about the implication of the cost of fuel in Uganda. Mm. This government is now becoming a big player in the sector. What are First these? of all, we have to know where the cost of fuel are determined. The plots, okay, that, that, that determination done at the international level, I cannot influence. But the factors that have been impacting on the fuel prices that are rotating around the Kenyan system is what I'm trying to come out of, okay? The international uh, uh, prices, I have no say. But the multi-layered system of Kenya, eh, which end up making the cost of the fuel at the pump price high, is what I'm trying to work out with. So I'm expecting that the cost will not be you know, uh, uh, increased because of the new uh, uh, policy, no. No, I don't expect that. And for the money, you watch the space, okay? Uh, I am not going to ask for money from Matia Kasaija to do the business. That would be bad. I have negotiated a smart business model that will not require sovereign guarantee. Okay? I am not running away to exile. I'll be here. <laughs> I'll be here when the business starts. This is the CEO of Uganda National Oil Company, together with his support staff, the one who makes calculations uh, for us, the ones that have, have been at the table negotiating a very good business model. They are here to bear witness. I am not going to come to Parliament to ask for money to do this business, but I'm going to make sure that Uganda is supplied with the products, okay? Isn't that good? Isn't that good? I think it is too good to be true. That's why I can see some of you, you know, your, your body language is that this woman now, we don't know where she's taking us. It's, it is too good to be true that we are going to do business as Uganda National Oil Company without asking for capital from government, from our, their shareholders, me and Matia Kasaija. It is too good to be true. Kati Oruale Ero Tuliwano, Nga Maze Okwanjula Ebago, Oba Enongo Sereza, Koteka Erikwata Uyamafta, Eriako Lebwa, Mungumi Bidi Mwesatu, Eriba Dedi Tuyamba Okulungamia, Ensubula Yamafta, Uganda. Emirundi Minji, Minister Webia Mafta, Oba Owa, Owa Bia Masanyana Ze, Nobuga Gobom Takiranga Ya, Ya Vnani Zivwa Kum Tambza, Yemirimu, Ejoku Ingiza Mafta Mugwanga, Oba Subula Mafta, Parliament Yeba Denge Muita Lunye, Miwabeira Wo, Emiwendo Kwe Kalamula, Minister Owa Mafta, Nga Iti Wabo Wa Energy, Nga Iti Woku Joku Nyonyola, Okwite Viam Parliament. Luacha mafuta gari wakulu. So government ya chirudeko nge ya system generator okulaba anga tuke endeza kwebio ebiba debitulete la mafuta gano kubanga gari nyari nyabu ni sawa. So nga echimu kwebio kwe koze sa company ya Uganda ea webwa okufuna anjisibwa okubele risori ya government mubi kwa ataku mafuta. Okufira dana mkugasima Okufira dala mkugalo ondola, mwe exploration, kusima mafuta, 
okuvira dala mu kuzimba emidumu ejigatambuza obane ejifulumya kurudu owa mafuta omudumu ogwo muwanvu okuyite Tanzania ekitongole kino company eno itwa Uganda National Oil Company iya webo funanyizibwo atenga ofunanyizibwo obo bwayingizibwa mu mateka akafuga so kumurundi kuno ni tugamba ndiyo no ebadde ekolo obusubuzi bwa mafuta na ye mu mpola mpola kubanga nga terina sente kuyingiza mafuta manji ngeri nakwe kwa ta partner okujiamba okuyingiza mafuta manji iranga ne storage obetterekero lya mafuta elili mikono ja company ene itwa you know elili ya jinja irana lyonga litereka mafuta matono milioni za lita uh, amakumi ya sato iranga tegamala so government ne kiriza kyokuvuna njizwa ku bukwase company ene ya you know na yeta andi ko busubuzi obwana madala esobolo kuguka mbusubuzo obo na yinga no kufuna sente efuna ate sobole uh, government esobole okuinvestinga oba okuzza mu sente ezo muyo yenyini government wawe twetaze ngecho okulabira ko twetaga sente okuzimba refinery twetaga sente okuzimba eterekere dene erigenda okuzimbibwa MPG kaino ligenda kubera mu milioni za za lita iza eza e, eza e, 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 mafuta ebikumi bisatu mwabiri nga tulino okulizima so kakati eteke eribadde wo erifuga obe erirungamya libadde terikiriza company kuveri wadenga company ya government kuveri kuyingira tietandi ko kusubula temubadde mukawayi lo kasobozesa company eno ya yuno okole echo no recho ne mvunanyizibwa mukulete nnongo osereza muteka eryo erifuga ebye nsubulaganya ya mafuta ero lwalero nyangize teka lino mu parliament nga speaker teka lino aliwereza mukachika akavunanyizibwa ku butonde bwensi na mafuta akanna cho resources kagenda dieke nenya katuyite katubuze ebibuzo kubanga twagala tutambulire wa mga tumanyiti police ene mpyaje tulese atete genda kulete da gwanga kubera awo nga tedili na mafuta ebintu bibiri waliwo kubana na mafuta nga gekala migali wagulu nga teto manya wencha tunakera gatunda se bagatunda sente mmeka kubanga bakama bafe babadde government ye Kenya nga yeyiya olwalo tulimu open tender system encha tugenze mu G2G government to government petuko bela bugoberezi kubanga tetulina abo yinzo no recho kastatu amanya kichecho kola ne tutandika okuteseganya ne government ye Kenya kubanga eteka lyensi yonna oba convention erirungamya abantu okwa accessinga C liba kakata ko okuwa Uganda omukisogo okwa accessinga emyalejo so tuba de mukuteseganya ne company ya pipeline ye Kenya yoka stoji sasula no funa space mu pipeline yeyo oja kuisa mu mafuta go banga tetugenda gabusa gani no kuita mu infrastructure ye Kenya era Kenya ja kusigalange funa sente kubanga we woka we tugenda kuisa mafuta gani ne license ze ndala you know ko zeri no kufuna e Kenya nazo tusubira okuzifuna kubanga nteseganya e ya police eno je tulese ebadde ngeva ku mutendero gwa ba president sababili nga bakiriziganya era na fe ba ministers ababili inze ne mwanyi naze chirichiri minister wa energy na mafuta owe Kenya tubadde twengejinga nga tubera mu meetings ezenja wo so we twala byenga chituse era ne tuita ne company ze nsubuza mafuta mu Uganda ne tutula nabo era ne tugula wo ne space mu yuno tibajja kubanga nga ba be bengejinga Uganda National Oil Company kubanga ino business bulamu ababa de mafuta bagala kulaba system wene pyaje muleta egenda tukosa oba tugenda kufuna era batufu okubuze ebibuze ebyo ngati tunatandika such that wobera we chetagisa 
tuchukole nga buchali ni yeso fa tubanyonyode ntuka mate twagala kusindikiriza mtu yena okujja ko yabadde nga lina byako langa taita mmateka kubanga kati eri eriso lya government you know ndigendo kubera mitambo okusubula mafuta okuva ebweru yo esubuze a uh, company za mafuta mu Uganda kati awo laba nga tuina leye mu yoka Unok ne partner wawe okuva ku Unok tudda ku OMC zine za Uganda so sikuita ku mitendera jiri esatu ejiri mu system ye Kenya tuba tukoze je baita shortcut mubango badde otambula olugendo ngo ovuga obuvuzi amafuta go okozesa okuita mu lugendo luli oluwanvu atesi go okozesa ngo ita mu shortcut so tusubira nte no system egenda kendeza ko factors ezibade zituletero obunkenke ekisoko okera ku macha nga to manyikinya che genda kuteka ko bwabe era wo mu nsi yonna scarcity ya mafuta kinyan system eso so waza companies zayo ngabwe bwali mu mwezo gwokuna nga musanvu minister nakera na alangirira we Kenya na gama cha mafuta gabade gagende Uganda kakati tusazeeko ku percentage amafuta tugawa de companies ndi zawa ne Kenya fo wano ne gafuka nga gabwerende bwe gafuka go bwerende mu chimanyi petrol station tie zikola zongera ko muwendo nenda la neziga kweka twagala kwe wala bintu ebyo tubenga you know egulira dala amafuta okuva ebwe eyo nge ina ba partners bayo era ne kila kye twino okumanya abantu bajja kwebuza kakati sente you know ke genda zijja wa company into you know ko yabadde ngezi nayo mu company zeri naze badde kola nayo ya sunsula mu company eri no busobozo obu Eline nsimbi yezo. Company ya vito nga CEO bwaba gambi. Nibate seganyana bo. Nibate kamu mundagano ya bwe. Nibate kamu ebe vyo na ebe joke safeguarding anti. Enchate vujia kucha. Nga drum nkalu. Echo sima nyi wenziru kida. Nga bukede. Nga drum nkalu. Sima nyi yuno kowe dukida. So tatte mu provision zezo nti wanabera wone stand by ship wali tujirabe nti eriawo eh okuziyiza okukala okwa drum obo kwa okwa okwa mafuta mu Uganda so chi ekitubeze za wano nja nsaba buwagizi obwa banna Uganda mu wagire company ya mwe te wabera wo abakozesa Okutandika okubuze ebibuzo ebire mesa Uganda oba government okutukiriza kino che tulowozeza tichigenda kutuyamba okutabera kubunkenke buli kasera lwabera we chintu e Kenya ni mbera kubunkenke uwe munabera mutya twagala kuwe wale ebyo nga tuyamba ko omwana wa Feyunok okukula ntina yeba mwe yune nga nafo we tugenda mu ba Adino bwe tugenda mu government companies za mafuta nga tubeginga tukolagane nabo twagala abantu na dalala mu region baje mu government company eyiti wa Uganda National Oil Company babebuze ko boba chikoze batya okola business ne bafuna milioni za dollars buli mwaka nabo basobola okukikola so nkola banna Uganda okusupporting a system weno tulabe nti tunataasibwa obunke enkobo otero okubera ko eteka le tutadde wo lwalero mu parliament ebbago obennongo osereza tusubira anti egenda mukachiko era akachiko ka parliament kagenda kutuita tunnyonyole babuze ebibuzo tunnyonyole oluvanyi ma report ye gem parliament tutandike kawairo kawairo bwairo buli butono nnyo obuli mu bage eliyo kuyingizamu mandate Uganda National Oil Company tiweredwa omukisogo okubanti yeleta amafuta eguze company zendala ereze bade zikola omulimu guno ekyo kubiri tine minister wa energy aweredwa olukusa nti singa tunalaba bantu munnyonyi batugamba in the unlikely events 
that there is a problem, this is what you do. Tisinga tunala manti, you know, obeli yao, oboli yao, tejia kusobola kukoli inga maftabu. Minister, where do you inza? Okune minga yo mtu omulala atali, you know. Ne yobu inza wa minister, buja kakasibwa cabinet. Siku wanga minister ina oil company, <laughs> jagendo kuwa business enu. So, cabinet ya ino kumpo luksa, atenga amba wade nsonga, jiba na endaba yuno ku, enduisi za wane hizo uta kula bulunji. Nsaba oluksa, nominate inge yeno, na yere itama futa. So, eyo na yo security. Era yuno, ichi, era yuno kechimanyi, security safeguards to start the war, kubanga tuwa gala, amafuta gabirewo all the time. Amafuta buwebula mo, amafuta buwebusai wa business, amafuta gegata ambuze kono me, e chibi era wocho na, chiba cha affecting ebila la, emini mujo nemi la lechi korebwa. So checho, uruwa lero, uh, kansamenti, akachiko uh, kapala, metikadja kuangu ya, kubanga ajagala mujanu alinga yuno kendete la amafuta. So nina november, atandi kencha, nina ne december. Ena kunkaga, kuno msai okutambuza evi obu subuzi. So tuwa gala chita andikile wo, ila neba za speaker, tia sobo do kumpo mkisa, eteka ino nendi e bago, uwe nongo seleza, nendi teka yoro wale no mparlament, so vila nchina kachiko kwa jia kuangu yako. Thank you so much. Kakati Buchanga, Bantu Bawinidi Zanti, and take a take a nature. Babe told Company Zibe told me. Never mock with Buzo Bimboza. Muchikiri de companies. Kubanga tuli mu business. En song eno ya tandi ka bili kumi na muenda. Bili kumi na muenda, you know, kuya sinkana oil companies. Neba tandi ka ente seganya, you know, enezi mbibuetia, tuna lunga miya tutien subula ya mafta. Nye tubadete tubi kole la kurutimbe. Kubanga mafuta sichi intu changu. Amafuta gali inga muanyi. Ensiyo nechi manyi. Oriol, okukamati o, o, ogenda kuyingiri lovu subuzibu wa mafuta. Haa, njuchi ziku eto olola. Eda yuno keno, tuwade tu, tu ino kuji protectinga. Kubanga oru e yingiri de. Na yo, muhu subuzibu wa mafuta. Muluzungu bazi itazi cartels. O ino kuchima nyanti, echama guze chiti buwa mafuta. Sicha muzanyo. So kati mwemula wanga haba papa. Nete tuwaga la mafumu gajia kwa avi ya chintu chetuleta. Kubanga, e chintu chetulimu tumanyi mulimu zikatels. Haba tona haba agaro kubanti veku saboba funa. Tebandi aga dekulaba anga mkugula u. Norecho mwemuchila vye nganza achangu ya. But this is the real timing. To, for me to strike, and I am striking. So this is the time. Era parliament ya nyambie nye mbuzi za emirundi ya emindi kum prices za mafuta. E nyambie ni ngamba wano mugezi afumita. Kubanga linda chigweyo. Afumita chi? Kakati mwabaga manti ipapa. Mwaga na afumite banga. Na inga atenze endaba. E nsoro wano katiere so mtue. Weni no kola chi? Afumitida.